proposing proposals to end crash facilities at four council-run leisure centres. Essentially, if they close all four crashes, then it's discrimination because we're supposed to have everybody in the city is supposed to have access to all the leisure facilities, and if they close all four crashes, then parents or carers of children under the age of three will not be able to have access to the facilities. Please save the remaining Edinburgh leisure crashes. Please do not remove this lifeline for so many people from the capital of Scotland. By closing all of the four remaining crashes, you are doing just that. 50 reasons why you should please save the Edinburgh leisure crashes. Because? Because they're part of the care network. And people like me who care for older people and younger people, we're just seeing it chipped away at everywhere and there'll be nothing left. There'll be nothing left to help people care. You know, so does Edinburgh Council care? Because Scotland is already known as one of the most unhealthy nations in Europe, um, Scottish Government targets and Scottish Council targets are to increase physical activity for all and increase the health of the nation. So we should save Edinburgh Leisure Crashes because it's ironic that they're closing with these targets that are currently in place. Because otherwise I won't be able to come to the gym because I, I need the crash for my child so that I can work out. Edinburgh Leisure is going to miss out because without the crashes, none of the mums are going to come here, therefore you're not going to get any money, so save the crashes. It's because this is meant to be a community based gym and I believe that the community should become come before profits. It's as simple as that. It's the future, community is the future and without that where are we? Thanks. Having the crash means I can come and do exercise and put this wee one in for an hour and he has fun too. Without that I'm stuck because in the evenings I have to study. I'm a busy mum and I've got to work as well. My only opportunity is my days off. Yeah. Thank you, fish. Because it is absolutely outrageous that in this day and age, mothers can't get access to a gym, leisure facilities to keep fit and live healthily if they can't put their children in. How are they meant to do that? What am I supposed to do with my child if I want to exercise? Because it will affect my wife and my son and my daughter's fitness levels and exercise activities. A vital resource for mothers with young children because it's a backward step, because everyone should have access to a healthy lifestyle, because Edinburgh families need support. Being able to exercise helps new mums get over postnatal depression. Save Edinburgh crashes because I rely on them and so do lots of other people. Because it's been one year since I've started exercising and I would not have started exercising had I not been able to use the crash facility. We want you to save the Edinburgh crashes because we rely on them. It's a good resource for me so I can get some time to myself and some exercise. Just because otherwise I couldn't come to the gym at all. It gives me time out in my day, it keeps me fit, um, which is obviously saving you money in the long run with the NHS, etc. So please help us save the cash so that we can carry on exercising. Thank you. Save Edinburgh Leisure Crashes because Edinburgh is a world class renowned international city. Tourist businesses come alike come here and want to visit Edinburgh. We're well known internationally. Now, Edinburgh Leisure provides world-class facilities to its inhabitants and to tourists that come and visit a city like this. I think it would be a sad day if we lost our fresh facilities because then the leisure centres would not be open to all and there would be no equity. Thank you. It's an act of discrimination against mothers who want to get out there and actually have a social life without having to pay for private childcare. Because it's really important that parents get an opportunity to exercise and know their children in safe hands. And there's no other facility like this in Edinburgh, and it's really important that it is saved. I will have to stop exercising if you close the leisure centre crash. Um, because it's really important that young mums can get out and exercise and be able to use the facilities that are available. Um, I've got two children under three, and it's a really important facility for me. It's the 21st century, and we all deserve access to these services. Because you're trying to promote health, but stopping women exercising by closing the crashes. I gave up work when I had my son, so that I could be a full-time mum. And my travel to work was my opportunity for exercise. I used to run to work. And now I don't have that opportunity. I'm a full-time mum. And the only way that I can get any exercise is if someone else can look after my son. Well, I do that, so we need to crash facilities in the leisure centres.
the crashes are really important for all new mums who want to get back into shape and to um, be able to use all of the gyms and facilities. And without the crashes, how are we ever going to get healthy again and get back into shape? Because it stops mothers taking part in activities that they enjoy. Because I won't be able to use these facilities if I couldn't get my son into a crash, therefore I couldn't enjoy the focus start until 2010. Save Edinburgh Leisure Crashes because it's discrimination for mothers who can't take their children to the crash, please. Because I don't get a chance to go, whereas my husband can go in, so I want I try and go. Mums need me time too. Um, our friends use them a lot, we really rely on them, and we hope to use them too in the future. It's good to know that facility is available, um, so please don't close them, it'd be really sad. As a new mum, it's really, really difficult to be able to keep fit, um, particularly in my position where I don't have family nearby. Without the crashes, I wouldn't be able to go and use the swimming pool and use the facilities. So it's really, really important to keep them, so please save them. For young mums to have somewhere to go that they can leave the children to return to exercise. My husband works really long hours, so there's no one to look after my baby, and obviously I want to try and get fit after having a baby, and there's no other way of doing it, so keep it open. Because I'm looking to use uh, the gym facilities and the swimming pools very, very soon. In fact, I tried to do it this week, but couldn't get her into the creche. So I would like to do it sooner so that she can participate and have activities with other kids in the creche and so I can get back to being fit again. Because I like to swim, and I swam all the whole time he was pregnant. I was pregnant with him, and I'd like to be able to go again, but if there's no creche, I won't be able to, to go. Because it's a lifeline for mums whose partners work crazy shifts, you can't guarantee nighttime um, classes, and I'll have to cancel my membership. Of course, they are depression. I would know what to do without it. It's a massive part of my life, and I'm going to have to stop all my fitness now because of it. Boys. I'm a grandmother, and I use it, and my two daughters joined, so they could use it, and now we're all going to have to leave the the. Input. Because um, this isn't just a facility for leaving the children where you go and do exercise. This is a facility for mums and, and parents and carers alike to meet other mums and parents and carers and for the kids to meet other kids. And while everybody is getting exercise done, um, making friends, getting a social life, uh, this at Aisley Park is more than just a leisure centre. It's more of a community centre and if you take away this facility it's going to take away so much more. On. Um, because I'm going to have to stop all my exercise. It's so important that children are allowed to play when their mothers are doing physically active things so that they can be fit and, and well and it's part of a whole uh, family environment. Very, very important that the child is there on the, on the premises, the mother can relax and yet keep it at the same time. So you've seen our video, you've seen our play, it's called 50 Reasons, and it's just the first 50 reasons why you should save these crash facilities. You've passed the motion, now please show the public how much you care about our community and save these crash facilities. All you have to do is ring fence some money in the budget proposals that you're just about to do and save the crash facilities. Thank you.